Hey, Burn. Welcome back to another video. So this is more stealing series. It's in the past nine days. Um. And what I mean by steel inventory stuff I have for like a long while on eBay, like f like maybe four, five, six months, like three months, like you know stuff that was on like either ten percent or now I've been recently doing the fifteen percent sales or it's stuff that I've had for a while. that might not just be um that might just be like you have to find the right buyer or seller might. Knowing you might take, you might know it takes a while to sell, but you list it anyways because you can make good return on it. And but it just takes a while to sell. Perfect too. So here's another thing that took a while to sell. This is a Briggs and Strand of Beal Sling. You can buy these brand new, you, um, not OEM. But these pe people pay for the OEM one. Some people that want OEM one will buy the OEM one. This is a Briggs and Strand of Beal Sling. Six nine nine nine. Um, but 699915 This sold for $18 on a best offer. And this took two months to sell. And you can see the views on this were not super high. Most for being two months old. But they someone sold for a dollar ninety nine plus shipping them like oh, what? But, but they did not get terror peak and see that the um, actuals um, new storage comes are a lot higher. So this is mine at 25 free ship. Someone offered me 18 free shipping and I took it. It's a pretty good deal. Just wrap it up, put a bow in and I call it good. Like it was pretty quick flip. It was pretty good flip. So 18 bucks off a of fuel system. It's pretty really, it's actually really good flip. Here's another flip. It took a little longer to flip. This took about three months to flip. This is part of a belt lot I bought from this Monty repair shop owner. Probably have a couple bucks in each belt. About dollar two in each belt. It's just the guy wants to get a bunch of inventory and cheap. And I bought him for This was $12 free shipping. I had listed like $13.49 shipped. And some of these belts do take a while to sell. Either your prices aren't right, or like they're a little too high, or there's no demand for it. And there was, I don't know, because the belt I did list it when it wasn't lawnmower season, so this might not be a popular belt to sell when it's not lawnmower season across the whole United States. Or other part, you know. But still sold for 12. Took three months to sell. I was just glad to see it go. The guy thought it was, the guy list in the book said probably in his book said the list of between sold for twenty and fifty. Nope, sold for twelve free ship. Got about say probably six five, six bucks off it, but probably five bucks off it, but what do you do, I mean? I'm just glad to see it go. This is a assorted NASCAR magazine, racing magazines, uh, 14, 1990s and 2000s race publishers. Now this was a pretty stale listing. This only had 200 views. And this took about nine months to sell. A little bit under, a little over nine months to sell. This, I sent an offer out. I had this listed for 450 plus ship 15 to the expedited shipping. Because you cannot list magazines in media. Shipping media. And... I had it on sale, 35% off eventually went to, and for stuff for nine months. Besides the beanies in the DVD cases, because they're names, it's plus ship names. You can't list. It's the lowest you can list it for by now. Nine cents, free ship for nine cents, plus ship names. But I sent them an offer. I sent the buyer a, a private offer of 99 cents plus shipping. And the person accepted. This is part of my magazine buy, or should I say NASCAR buy? Malco Auctions. I made like a quarter off this after shipping and fees. But I was just glad to see it go, honestly. This is Walk the Dogs board game. It has about this Malco Thrift Store, brand new sealed for 
$4.99. Finally, I sold it for $27.54 plus shipping. If you see sealed board games, pick them up. Pick them up. Because they might not be worth a ton. Brand, a you, um, used, you might have the inventory, and who knows if they're perf complete. At like a thrift store. At like a garage sale, you might be able to get like um, more money. You might be able to, I'd buy them from a garage sale that, if I would. Because they're more, um, more of a chance of um, being complete. Or you can like chuck them over there at the sale. But this was five bucks. I sold for twenty seven fifty four on five percent sale. Had about three months. And plus shipping that is. So it was about like a twenty dollar profit. So not too shabby right there. For and then I sold this took a, like about three and a half months, so this was pretty I was just glad to get rid of this. So um, this, these books, these is a book lot of five. The children's book about how we have good series by Joy Berry. These are books like to help your kids like be good. They like, teach kids rules on like common like household rules. Like parents are for kids like telling, being boss, being greedy, being careless. And there's a vintage one, an older one, a disobeying one. Is older. There's it still help me be good series one. And it sold for five plus shipping. Five dollars on that on sale eight ninety nine. Then I had fifteen percent sale for seven sixty four plus shipping. And buyer uh, offered me five and I'm like sold. Get rid of it. And it's three returns. Buyer pays return shipping. And I'm just glad um get um that's the reason I offer three returns. Buyer pays return shipping is because. I don't mind, um, I don't mind offering returns, like, I started offering paid return, made buyer pay, it because I figured, I offer it, I started doing just free shipping, only free shipping, and if I did free shipping, I figured I'd let the buyer, make the buyers pay for return shipping, and I offered the return shipping both ways, to free shipping and free returns. And then, I ch then some names I went to charge and shipping for, and I still do the same method. Make the buyer pay for return shipping, and then they have to pay the shipping too, and the return sh they return to me. And help and plus on like the bigger box rooms, I got charge shipping on, like especially because um. Like the bigger in box rooms, uh, don't want to pay free returns on because it's so big. It costs us the return. Sure.